Hey, are you okay? Let me look at you. Easy, easy, just let me see. Sorry, sorry, but those bruises look nasty. What happened? You didn't trip. I mean, you're clumsy, but you're not this clumsy. Are you? Down the stairs. Jesus, it's a miracle you're still breathing. You could have knocked yourself out. Hmm? They called me. The nurse did. I'm still your emergency contact on your phone. What do you mean? I came because I was worried. They called and said you were in the ER and refusing treatment. So, could I please come talk some sense into you? So here I am. Why are you refusing treatment? Yeah, you do need it. They need to look at your head. Hey, look at me. You need to get looked at. I know I can't tell you what to do. But I'm strongly encouraging you to get looked at. Fine. I can't force you. But they won't release you on your own. So, your choice. Hospital tests? Or coming home with me? I mean it. I'm not budging on this. Really? Okay, I'll grab your stuff while you sign out. All good? Can you stand all right? Good. Go slow. No, I can carry it. My car is outside. This way. So, um... Hospital accidents aside, how have you been? Look, it's not easy for me either. I mean, it's been six months. How are... things? Possible concussion aside. Sorry, I... I promise no more awkward questions. I mean, hey, we aren't together anymore, so... <sighs> hey, hey, eyes open. You okay? I can turn around. I... Okay. Okay. Here we are. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I moved a month ago. Just couldn't stay at our place anymore. Hey, you don't need to apologize. I mean it. I'm glad that I could help. Lord knows you can't take care of yourself. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'll stop. Don't punch me, jeez. You're still pretty feisty, huh? So, how do you feel? 
Craig? What? Hey, why are you crying? You don't need to apologize. Shh. Hey. It's me. Okay? I've seen you in worse situations than this. And you've seen me like that too. I mean, we were together for three years. You probably know me better than anyone else. And I know you. I know you were freaking out because I showed up and you weren't expecting it. But just breathe. Come on. In. And out. In. And now. There you go. Better? Could I get you anything? Tea? No, I know. I just kept a box. I don't know why. Do you still take cream and sugar? Cool. Okay. Here we go. Tea's got a brew, but should be ready to go soon. Yeah, well, after living with you, I mean, I guess I got the habit of having tea on hand. Really? You still have it? No, I... I just figured out after everything happened, you would have thrown it out. I'm glad. Yeah, well, what can I say? You bring out the sap in me. Hmm? You... You missed me? Are you serious right now? I mean, this isn't the possible head injury talking. If I hadn't shown up tonight, what would you have done? It does matter. It matters to me. See, you always do this. You always pull away when things get too tough. You never want to open up. This is why we broke up. I know, I know, but babe, you have to let those walls down. Wait. No. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to call you that. It's been six months and I guess it's been a crazy night. Sorry. Look, um, you can take the bedroom. I'll sleep here. No, no, it's fine. What? Yeah, I remember that. You, um, you tripped in those heels. You were so pissed. I had to carry you back to the hotel. Mm hmm? Really? You remember that? I mean, that was our what? Fifth date? You still have them. Wow. No, I just mean you kept those flip flops. I mean, I bought them for like 10 bucks. They weren't even cute. But you kept them? 
You're... You're wearing them now. Hey. Listen. I miss you. A lot. And I know we had some problems, but I want to work on them. I want to be with you. That first week you weren't with me, I felt like my whole world had just gone dark. There was no color there anymore, just darkness. And I've been existing. I've been trying to get over you, failing miserably at it. So, when they called, when they said your name and that you were at the hospital, so many things came rushing back. Regrets, wishes, dreams. I want you. Emotional walls and all. I want you. The clumsy girl who falls down the stairs and gives me a heart attack every other week. I want your smile, which is warmer than the sun. I want your worries so I can help. I want you. So, what do you say? I'll take that as a yes. Okay. Good. You've had a rough day. Yeah, babe. I missed you too. Thank you for listening. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more of my voice. Shout out to the patrons as always, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.